Yet another resource for Brookhaven Police, drones will soon patrol the DeKalb County City, helping to catch crooks and help first responders reach people who have been hurt. Our Tori Cooper has more. Yeah, the Brookhaven Police Department will now be deploying eight of its new drones from launch pads just like this one on top of this 17 story building in Buckhead to get an extra set of eyes on the scene. It's the newest first responder for the Brookhaven Police Department. Community safety. Having these drones as the first responders on the scene will enable our officers to know exactly what's going on at the scene before they ever arrive. On Monday, the department unveiled its new set of eight drones that will now be positioned at eight different launch pads in high crime areas in Metro Atlanta. Brookhaven Police Department can remotely assess the situation, determine what resources are needed, and muster up those resources, keep both our community safe and our officers, officers safe. We can cancel our ground units that may have to respond if there is no evidence that a crime is being committed. The department says the drones will be used only for tactical and emergency use. They will only record while responding to 911 calls, not for randomized surveillance. So far, drone response times are under two minutes. The drones helping fight crime more efficiently from above before officers hit the ground. The Brookhaven Police Department and UAS team is comprised of 16 licensed UAS pilots. All of our pilots are licensed to operate unmanned aircraft uh, below 50 pounds. The aerial team is already in the sky responding to calls for service, helping make the future safer in Brookhaven. Wonderful for community safety. It's wonderful for the safety of our officers, and it's wonderful for the advancement of police protection. Now, as you can see, they are still testing the drones to make sure they are ready to go, but we will make sure that we bring you the very latest update on when they are taking to the sky officially to help fight crime. Reporting in Bucket, I'm Tori Cooper, CBS 46 News.